Hello everyone and welcome to our video series on Learn German for Beginners. Today we'll be learning possessive pronouns in German such as my, your, their, etc. Lektion 24 Possessive Pronomen in Nominativ Possessive Pronomen are also sometimes mentioned as Possessive Article. For every pronoun in German, there is a Possessive Pronoun. Let's do the first one. The pronoun is ich and the possessive pronomen in nominative are mein or meine. Let's see how they are used. Hi, ich bin Peter. Ich komme aus Hamburg. Das ist mein Fernseher. Whenever the article of the noun is there, you use the possessive pronoun mein. Das ist mein Auto. For nouns with article das, we use the possessive article mein. Das ist meine Katze. And when the article of the noun is the, the possessive article that's used is meine. Das sind meine Bücher. In case of plural, when the article is the, the possessive pronoun that's used is meine. So once again, in the case of masculine and neutral, your possessive pronoun in nominative would be mein, whereas in the case of feminine and plural, it would become meine. That means you just add an E to mine. Now this was for the personal pronoun ich. Let's come to du. Here, my possessive pronouns will be dein oder deine. Let's see how to use them. Wie heißt du? Woher kommst du? Ist das dein Fernseher? Ist das dein Auto? Ist das deine Katze? Sind das deine Bücher? So, in this case also, for masculine and for neutral, you would say dein and for feminine and plural, you would use deine. The next pronoun is er and the possessive pronoun for er are sein or seine. I'm sure by now you know that when the article is der or das, you use sein and when the article is die in singular or in plural, you would use seine. Now let's see how to use them. Das ist Peter. Er kommt aus Berlin. Das ist sein Fernseher. Das ist sein Auto. Das ist seine Katze. Das sind seine Bücher. Let's come to the singular pronoun for feminine. Sie. And the possessive pronouns in nominative are ihr or ihre. Let's see how to use them. Das ist Julia. Sie kommt aus Frankfurt. Das ist ihr Fernseher. Das ist ihr 
Auto. Das ist ihre Katze. Das sind ihre Bücher. So once again, you use ihr when the article is der or das and ihre when the article is die in feminine or in plural. Coming to the next pronoun, es. Here, the possessive pronomen are same as that of er. That is, sein or seine. And now let's see how to use them. Das ist ein Kind. Es ist fünf Jahre alt. Das ist sein Fernseher. Das ist sein Auto. Das ist seine Katze. Das sind seine Bücher. Just like all other possessive pronouns, even in this case, when the article is there or thus, you say sein, and whenever the article is the in feminine or plural, you say seine. Now we come to the pronoun wir. The possessive pronouns for the same are unser or unsere. And now we learn how to use them. Wir sind eine Familie. Das ist unser Fernseher. Das ist unser Auto. Das ist unsere Katze. Das sind unsere Bücher. So here also you should remember that when the article is there or thus, you would say unser. In the case the article is die for feminine or plural, you would say unsere. Now let's come to the next pronoun. Ihr. The possessive pronouns are euer or eure. This is a little tricky, but you have to remember this. Whenever you write eure, you just don't add an e at the end. You also remove an e after the u. Now let's see how to use them. Wie heißt ihr? Woher kommt ihr? Ist das euer Fernseher? Ist das euer Auto? Ist das eure Katze? Sind das eure Bücher? So, once again, for the articles there and thus, we use euer and for the article the in plural and feminine, we use eure. So, the next one is Z in formal form, singular and plural. For both of them, the possessive pronoun is the same, ihr or ihre. Let's see their usage. So for the first situation, where it's sie, singular, sind sie Herr Müller. For the second situation, where it's in plural, sind sie ein Team? Ist das ihr Fernseher? Ist das ihr Auto? Ist das ihre Katze? Sind das ihre Bücher? So for sie, whether in singular or in plural, the possessive pronouns are ihr 
or ear. Ear is used when the article is the or thus and ear is used when the article is the in singular or in plural. Now coming to the last pronoun Z. This C is small and it's the plural form for RZS. The possessive pronouns here are ear or ear. Now let's learn how to use them. Das ist ein Paar. Sie wohnen in Deutschland. The Z here is written in capital because it's at the beginning of a sentence. Das ist ihr Fernseher. Das ist ihr Auto. Das ist ihre Katze. Das sind ihre Bücher. So once again, when the article is there or thus, you would say ihr. And when the article is die, for feminine or for plural, you would say ihre. Great! So here is a table for all the possessive pronouns we have just learned. Depending on the gender of the noun, you use either mein or meine for ich, dein or deine for du, sein or seine for er and s, ihr or ihre for sie feminine, unser or unsere for wir, euer or eure for ihr, ihr or ihre for both the sie, ihr or ihre for sie. Do try to make your own sentences the way we did in the beginning of the chapter. Hope you enjoyed this lesson. Danke! Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, do give me a thumbs up and do share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos. If you have any questions or comments, write them in the comment section. Tschüss! Auf Wiedersehen!